like, why isn't it loading? Mm -hmm. There it goes. Oh, these... Oh, these waves! Oh, look out, Link! Wait, who's that on that boat? Oh, it is Link! I thought it would be. Oh, look out for that rope! Oh, wait, the rope's not the danger, it's the waves. Oh, it is, it's him! Oh, no. oh. Are they going to explain why he transforms into a toy in the dream, yeah, too? I am not just a myth. <laughs> this shit. Fucking transformed into Playmobiles. How have they not made toys of this game yet? Maybe they have. I need to buy them. They made an amiibo. Yeah, have, they not, the amiibo. have they not made other toys? Because I'd buy the shit out a of waste them. Wasted potential. A waste of potato. Hey, Eric, uh, hey everybody, I'm Samuel K. Joining me is my friend Eric. Um, what is, uh, can I, can I describe the, let, let me describe our dynamic to, uh, to the people that are watching this. How's that? Born in a present <laughs> state, never were babies we rule where no man has been. With nobility of non-humanity. What's the next part? Can you, uh, do you have a question you need to ask me, Eric? Do you have any children or kin? We have no children or kin! Hey. <laughs> uh, we're playing uh, Linky Wakey. <laughs> For like, wake up, wake. Wake up. You ever been to put a little makeup? That's what I called the, uh, <laughs> that's what I called the stream this time. What do you think of that? Uh, <laughs> is that it? I still can't tell if that's a different shield than the one that I have. I don't think it is. I don't think so. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. We've got a... all the other shields. Okay. Well, we need to take Malin or Marin. Whatever you want to call her. Mark Marin. Oh, look! He's in. Get off your head. What are you doing? What the fuck? Didn't know that was an option. Okay. That's rude. How'd your Christmas go, Eric? You get anything cool? Mm, not really. <laughs> oh, well. I mean, money, yeah, that's cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, there's a bunch of shit all over my uh, Nintendo controller, too. What's going on here? Did something get spilled in Sam, here? what are you doing? I just tried to push down the button for Rock's runny shoe. Oh, no. <laughs> and there's goop on my controller. What happened? This is like glue. Uh-oh. Hold on, I'm using a pair of scissors to scrape it up what out of the- done? What is this? It's really thick, and it's like not coming off, so I think it's some kind of glue or solvent? Alright. Uh oh, that's not good. No. Okay, there, I got the button. <laughs> oh no, the button's sticking. Holy shit, Eric, hold on, I got a razor blade here on my desk too. You know, this was sitting on top of my, uh... On top of my computer case, I hope there's none of this shit down in my new computer. Oh god. <laughs> I'll be very upset. <laughs> Hang on. I've got the <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome to my stream as I uh, clean what appears to be glue off of my... Uh... Mm. But it's like, it's like an epoxy almost. Yeah. What the fuck? That's the real mystery. Yeah, what happened? Well, I better keep track of where I threw this razor blade. I just kind of... That's just why there's glue all over my shit in my room. <laughs> there we go. Man, what are you doing? 
Come on, Marin, try to keep up. I like these mushroom guys. Yeah, they're neat. Hmm. I think I'm going the right way. Yep. I think no. Wait, can I get I back there? Right. Thing? Hold on, I'm gonna see if I can get back into the back of this building yet. Oh yeah. Frogs everywhere. Frogs everywhere. <laughs> Frogs everywhere. I am forever in your debt getting my leaves back. Okay, thanks. Yeah. I guess. Here's what it is. I think he's from a different game. Is he? Like some old NES game. Want to see it's true. Uh... I should have jumped. There you go. What do we got, Melon? It's just a shell. A shell. It's Michelle. Hi, Michelle. From um, Full House. Yeah. Remember her? You got it, dude. I said that to uh, I said that to my boss the other day, and she said, "Why'd you call me, dude?" And I'm like, "You know, Full House." She didn't know what I was talking <laughs> about. So that's how seriously I take my job and my work is that I I quote Full House at my boss when she tells me to do something. It's a wonder I have I've ever been employed in my life. <laughs> You've been back here, right? Yeah, I have, but I didn't get that uh, heart piece that's back here. Oh, huh. Remember? Oh. Why did I not go get that? Oh, I have. I didn't have jump ability yet. There we go. Yeah. I couldn't do that yeah. yet. Look at that! I've completed one! Wait, how do I get out of here now? Uh -oh. There, okay. In soil sleep secrets! Beneath your souls! Oh yeah, I forgot. She just completely fucking freaks out when we dig, yeah. doesn't she? Oh, I tried to jump, but I was holding a rock. You can't jump on a rock. You can't jump holding a rock. Crazy. That's a clever joke. Was that in the original, Eric? Uh, by the way. It's funny. I don't remember. Remember that Chumbo Wumba song? I don't remember. <laughs> have I been over here? Yeah, I have. <laughs> All right. Sorry, Melon. Marin. <laughs> Hi, Tyler. Welcome to. Oh, wait. My overlay is on. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Boop. There's the overlay. Oh, it's. It's backwards? You're almost forgot again. <laughs> what happened here? How is it backwards? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well. Well, let's leave it. It's funny. <laughs> Good grief. Oh, I should have picked another GIF to put up there. We're doing, like, Web 1.0 GIFs at the top was a theme for, like, two weeks. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna leave it backwards. I kind of like it like that. 
I like it. I like it like that. Do you think... <laughs> do you think her name's like a, a pun on melon? Because she's Malin. Yep. Oh, all the chat's backwards, too. How the hell did that happen? I'm not sure. You know, I was drinking on Christmas, <laughs> and I was messing around in OBS. I wonder if I did it then. <laughs> Because that seems like something I might have that might have done. Possibly. You never really know with drunky, you know. He gets up to some stuff. Yeah, the thing with drunky is he's full of surprises, you know. <laughs> And they're not always good surprises. No. <clears throat> but by God, Drunky and I come as a package mm -hmm. deal. Can't have one without the other, Rick. That's what they say. Where am I even going? How do I look yeah, at my map? Yeah, Where's my map? Oh, I'm almost there. Okay. We gotta wake up the, uh... The walrus. The windfish. Yep. <clears throat> I like the little dog barks music. <laughs> And then it's a cat. Me too. I wonder if I get anything with green... Yeah, look, you can eat the little apples. Hmm. Yes, it's that lazy roller. Shall we give him a little surprise? Yes. She pulls out a knife. <laughs> Come here, no... He's happy. Yay. He's dancing. <laughs> oh, look at Link's face. He's like, what the <laughs> fuck? Uh, he's calling me. It's the same as always. Ha ha. All right. I'll follow her there. Let's just go look. The animal village is right over here. Oh look, she's singing to a toucan and a raccoon, yeah, a raccoon. and some some rabbits. <laughs> hey, that's a nice ocarina you have there. Will you accompany me as I sing? Yeah, sure. Yeah, you bet. So, how do you like it? It's really touching, and it doesn't stick in your mind. Yeah. You learn the Ballad of the Windfish. Oh, he might be a bear, yeah. I like those. They ought to put a um, an Easter egg in a Zelda game where if you play the Ballad of the Windfish on one of Link's instruments, you get like, I don't know, a couple yeah. hearts or something. That'd be cute. I tried to do that in Ocarina of Time a few times. Nothing happened. 
We're in the Yarna Desert, dude. Oh, it's spinies. Pokies. Spokey spinies. Yeah, they are pokies, pokies, aren't they? Spinies are the ones that Lakitu throws at you. Yeah. I tell you about, uh, speaking of, uh, Pokey, I'm gonna talk about Pocky. I bought, uh... Gumby. Oh, those do hurt you if you bump into them. Speaking of Gumby, I bought Cordelia some Pocky while she and the family were visiting. And, uh... Uh-huh. She, uh, ate the whole package of Pocky that I bought her. <laughs> except for half of one stick of Pocky. <laughs> so she physically had it in her hand and in her mouth and did not eat the rest of it. Oh, that's too much. <laughs> yeah, right! Wow, this looks like a cool Unity fan game. Fiddle, you always come in here <laughs> saying negative shit. What's your problem, man? <laughs> I think this game looks really pretty. It's right in the name. <laughs> uh, sea Bears Foam. Sea Bears <laughs> Dreams! Oh, Sleep Bears Dreams. Uh, both in the happy. same way. Crash! Yeah, you should be happy, Fiddle. Maybe that's your problem, is you... Annoyance! You are only getting in the way! Who is this guy? Maybe that's your problem. You've, you've branded yourself as as unhappy. Now you've... You're, you're, oh, this guy's it's gross. a self-fulfilling prophecy. Yeah, he's kind of nasty. Like a house said to me. Ugh. Oh, can I just go... Kill him? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do I have any bombs? Yeah, I do. Look at this. Think you can hide that from me? Do you think that I'm just some bumpkin that just fell off a turnip truck? Look! We got it. They are fighting for what are known as cause. Causes. Causes. Good causes? Sometimes. <laughs> when you're feeling blue, we'll turn you pink! Jesus Christ. Did you lose... Tyler, you're a... You are a bumpkin. <laughs> I mean this in the nicest way. <laughs> Did you fall off a turnip trunk? Truck? Tyler, would you consider yourself to be a hayseed? How do I kill this guy? Ah. I'm gonna hit him in the head. His head is red when he comes out. Oh, whoops. Or fall in the hole. Or I'll fall in the hole. <clears throat> what is... Okay, so what's a... I don't know. Are you a bumpkin or a hayseed? Like, what would be, like, Mississippi as far as... Bu like, bumpkin and hayseed? Because I always think of bumpkin and hayseed more as, like, rural Midwest, maybe. Like, Oklahoma or something. What's the... What's the southern version of a bumpkin or his hayseed. Like, I think that I would be a hayseed, because I come from a rural community. I don't know. Oh, yeah, it is just hit him in the head. I guess... Are there hills in Mississippi? Are there hills in which to yeah, be a huh. billy? I don't know, I think so. 
Uh, northern Mississippi. Yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah. Yeah. Tyler, you're a hillbilly. Son of a bitch. It's hard to get like, him in the yeah. head. I like the effect on the... The uh, footprints. As I get sucked into the... Oh, I need to look. I didn't notice. Oh, yeah! <laughs> that is nice. Oh, speaking of uh, Mountain Dew, I had a Red Bull the other day. What the fuck? I just keep doing it. I keep going, oh, I'll get in front of it. We're going to be here a while, I think. Is that guy always going to get me? Yep. Here, let me load up on my hearts here. <laughs> um, I had a Red Bull the other day. I got one of the winter edition ones that are plum flavored. Uh -huh. Guess what it tasted like? Battery acid. Because it's a Red Bull and it's disgusting. <laughs> yep. Uh, but I was I was very sleepy because I hadn't slept. Because you know sometimes Eric you just don't sleep. I didn't sleep last night either. You know. Yeah, that was. Okay. I was up until six a.m. Uh. I was uh I was reading the uh the graphic novel Transmetropolitan by Warren Ellis. And uh let me just say that uh, had a lot more appeal to it when I was like 17 and read it the first time. Oh. <laughs> it's still pretty good. It's it's not as grating oh, and horrible the... as uh mm -mm. Spider Jerusalem. Yeah, the uh Futuristic yeah. dystopia Hunter S. Thompson inspired character. Right. Wait, what? Oh, good, it fell down here. Drive that key. You got a key! It's the angler key. Don't you fucking touch me. Don't you um, do it. The fuck was I even talking about? It was something that was making me slightly angry. Transmetropolitan. Transmetropolitan, yeah. I don't know. It's it's um So one of my big shames in life is that I have a Hunter S. Thompson Gonzo Fist tattoo on my shoulder. I'm, yeah. <laughs> I'm in no way proud of it because uh when I was when I turned twenty I realized, oh, this guy was kind of just kind of an abusive dickhead <laughs> who just did a bunch of drugs, and I thought that was really cool when I was 17, 18, oh, wow. got the tattoo. And, and to be fair, doing lots of drugs does make you really cool if there are any kids watching. <laughs> I mean, there are people that have made dumber mistakes in their life. Oh, look, Alex is online. Hi, Alex. Uh, he was the, uh, art director for Swords of Ditto on, uh, uh, that video game, The Swords of Ditto. Uh -huh. I think he did that. Maybe I'm lying. He does something. He's an artist on Twitter that I know. I think that was Alex. I never see anybody come online on my Switch, because I hardly ever play it. Sadly. I need to get Mario Maker. I'd play the shit out of some of that. Yeah. Uh, where am I supposed to take this angler key? To the angler... Dungeon. I don't know where that is. Hmm. I'll go check in with Ula... Ula Lilia. I'll go check in with Ula Lilia. <laughs> yep, that's how you call the phone. Gotta talk to your mom, Bumsy. Hoot! The shape of the key shows a fish 
swimming up a cascade river. Go to the mountain oh, waterfall and leap from the top and you will reach your goal. Oh, oh. Later, bitch. All right, bye. Me eat a apple. Well, Link, I know he, in Breath of the Wild, he definitely does, because you make, uh, you make various, like, potions and stuff, and potions yeah. are drugs. What is it? Eric, here's a question for you. Where am I going, first off? Tall, tall heights? That's a waterfall up there. Uh -huh. Okay, so how am I going to get there? I'm probably going to have to cut... Oh, let's go to the animal village and warp. Because there's a thing down here. Yep. And then warp as far north as I can go, I guess. Um, okay, Eric. So here's my question, right? At what point... Like, okay... Is like Robitussin a potion, technically? Yeah, yeah I guess. So. <laughs> I, mean... <laughs> I guess that's my question. You know what, yeah, a tincture. <laughs> like it's. Does that count? <laughs> like when I've got a cold and I take Nyquil, did I just take a potion? A magic potion. <laughs> or day yeah, right? It puts can't... You to sleep. <laughs> right. It makes me have crazy dreams. <laughs> Boy, oh boy, I used to have a NyQuil habit. Remember that shit, Eric? When I drink like half a bottle of NyQuil at night and freak out. <laughs> I was a oh, fucking God. mess back then. <laughs> oh, ow. I seriously probably went through like five bottles of NyQuil a week just drinking it. God. <laughs> Cough syrup, tons of it. <laughs> I still really like the taste of cough syrup. This, my friend, is the only way for you to leave the island. Alright, cool. See, I've always imagined that when you drink a potion in a game, it tastes like like NyQuil or Robitussin. Right. <laughs> oh, look. The egg. Alright. A big pink egg. Uh, Dompe Shack, no. bring me the weird stones you find. No, fuck off, Dompe. That was boring. <laughs> <laughs> boring? You don't know from fun. This is responsible. <laughs> There's us. I, I want to go through our uh, video oh. catalog, Eric. And just make a supercut of every time, we, specifically, we quote that episode of Space Ghost. Right, nice and long quotes. And I've, I've got, I've got close to seven hundred videos on my YouTube channel. I bet six hundred and fifty of them right. have a knife and around quote in them. <laughs> Whoops. Ah. Hmm. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna Oh shit. God damn it. <laughs> okay, I think. Okay, that reset the whole thing, which is fine. Yep. Okay, I want to push that down there. I want to go hit that and then get off of there. Then I think I want to push that rock down. Because really, that's the only place it can go. Unless I can jump... Diagonally? Ow. 
Why is that thing Damn shooting me bad. all of a sudden? What the fuck? I didn't fucking do slime. anything. The slime appeared. Oh. What the fuck? Why is it shooting at me with the slime there? Because of enemies. It does have enemies around. Bullshit! On screen. <laughs> Fuck out of here, you piece of sh God damn it. You're good. You got it. It was too easy. It was all too easy, Starscream. Much easier, almighty Megatron, than the <laughs> real threat, the Autobots Moon Base! You're an idiot, Starscream. <laughs> Once we slip past their defenses and attack Autobot City, the Autobots will be vanquished forever! And then uh, there's that part where that one um, that one Autobot is laying on the ground and uh, he grabs uh, Megatron by the ankle and he goes, <laughs> No! And then Megatron goes, Such heroic nonsense! And then shoots him in the face with his gun arm. I think it even looks sharp for us. You remember that part from... from the I do. 1985 Transformers movie. Much easier, mighty Megatron! I think I do a pretty good star screen. <laughs> yeah, that's how I like him. Just because he's high-pitched and screams. that That's one thing that I can accomplish yep. with my <laughs> voice talents. It's high-pitched screaming. <laughs> Oh, look at that. Very nice. <laughs> so, I'm under the impression that these <laughs> things here, Eric, are like jellos, but they pop like balloons. Yeah. <laughs> Those are weird. <laughs> Who's your favorite character in Transformers, Eric? Uh, I like Bumblebee. Bumblebee's a good choice. Uh, mine's Starscream, clearly. And the, and the old guy, I like. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bumblebee, whatever. Uh, Cup. <laughs> My favorite. Micro Machine Guy. Oh, God. It's the worst Can character in this movie. <laughs> Woof. <laughs> ah! I really love that movie. Ball of wheat, grow oh, my wheat, Jimmy Bone. Remember that? Ah, Popo got lost, just like he said. Now I'm so famished I can't move. Can you give me some vittles? Yeah. Here, I have a okay. pineapple. Bon appetit! Just eat the whole thing. <laughs> ah, a hibiscus. Ooh. Oh, somebody wanted that. I can't remember who. Oh. Uh... Yeah, I don't remember. Huh. Huh. We'll just have to go talk to everybody. Alright. Now, I think there was a lady... Like near Animal Village, maybe that wanted it. Maybe it was the the hippo. I don't remember. Oh yeah, it might have been the hippo. Why is Ayn Rand disappointed in me? Free I don't get it. Pie, pineapples, maybe? Maybe? Feeding a hungry man? I don't know. I shared pineapple with that man. It's because I'm a nice person and Ayn Rand wasn't. What, is that all that's up here? Mm -hmm. 
I think you have to go back down to activate the. Oh, okay. Like this Fine. What was Ayn Rand's whole deal? I've never read Atlas Shrugged or really read anything about it. I don't give a fuck about her. Come on, Tyler. Tyler! You rascal. Yeah, I gotta go down there. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm not right there. Yeah. Well, I can't go this way, because it just won't let me go here. Right. This way. I disagree with that. I I feel like the um. I feel like the uh, the true definition of love is sacrificing what you want for the good of somebody else. I agree. Uh, making those compromises is important, and if you're truly to love somebody, love your fellow man. Oh, there's a door there. Mm. If you're truly going to love your fellow man, uh, you'd be generous and you'd be kind. Because you know what? Kindness is pretty cool. Yes. Yeah. Just like Kevin Spacey said in his most recent weird video he uploaded on Christmas. <laughs> Kill him with kindness. <laughs> oh. Nope. Oh, oh. That may not have been what I needed to do. <laughs> I'll fiddle around with it, though. We'll look. You sucker. Um, yeah, did you see Kevin Spacey released another one of those videos? Of him as Frank Underwoods at, at the Christmas time? I watched it. It's just him, and he goes, You didn't Sorry. think I was going to let the day go by without saying Merry Christmas to you? <laughs> when somebody says something mean about you, you kill him with kindness. Uh, not just one of his victims dying mysteriously, Tyler. There have been four that have died um. in either apparent suicides or uh, car crashes or, like, yeah, under mysterious circumstances. Hmm. And Kevin Spacey is friends with Jeffrey Epstein and the Clintons. Huh, I wonder. It's interesting. Curious to me. Wonder what's going on. <laughs> One thing we can all be sure of nobody will ever be brought to justice because they have a lot of money and power. Here we go. Yay! I mean, that's the the kind of company they keep. Is is fellow, right? Cretans. <laughs> I. <laughs> that's how you can be friends with them. They have common interests, which are fucking killing poor people. <laughs> like, <laughs> good lord! I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about Jeffrey Epstein or the Clintons or anything me today. Either. Makes me sick. <clears throat> um, 
So, uh, oh, I got an airbrush, Eric, for Christmas. Very excited Ooh. about it. Um, I also got myself a, uh, a big nice. pyramid mold for my resin. I'm going to make some power pyramids. Because, as you know, uh, <laughs> power uh, lies in the shape of the triangle, because it is the strongest shape, both physically mm. and spiritually. <clears throat> of course uh, I do that. Of course I'm going to use my airbrush to doctor photos. <laughs> I'm, go I'm going to use it, Tyler, to, um, to um, add in suffering people to Holocaust photos like the United States government did. <laughs> No, I'm not going to do a Holocaust denier bit right after talking about Jeffrey Epstein. <laughs> Come on. It's bad enough that I constantly talk about Eric being a Scientologist. And... <laughs> I know, I'm awful. Just saying crazy shit about my friends. <coughs> Okay, I'm going to head back up there. Sam, I told you not to bring that up. Sorry. Come on. You're ruining my campaign. Oh, I have another thing. I have another thing. Uh, just on the Jeffrey Epstein thing, right? <laughs> just, to, just to put another person in the spotlight, Prince Andrew... Right. Uh, he made that fucking uh, interview on Channel 4 right. where he was like, well, after he was convicted, I only went to his house three or four times a year. Yeah, you only went to a convicted pedophile's house three or four times a fucking year. Yeah, only three or four times a year I was hanging out with this fucking monster. That's not so bad. It was only a couple times a year. And then they were like, so what did you do there? And he's like, oh, I'd be in the States. And then he'd know I was there. And he'd say, you can stay at my house. And I'd say, oh, thank you. <laughs> no, and, yeah, like, you're one of you're part of one of the richest monarchies in the entire fucking <laughs> world. You can't stay at a fucking Motel 6. Like, you just... Ah! <laughs> They're not even good at the lies they tell. Like... I don't know how it works with monarchies, but, um, is it illegal for me to say that I want him killed? Probably. Well, I'll at the very least get banned from Twitch, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Please note, I did not say that I did want him killed. I just asked if it was legal for me to say that. <laughs> okay. For legal purposes, I did nothing wrong. <laughs> Alright, let's get into this dungeon, Eric. I'm, my sword is thirsty for blood. Oh, I can't oh, swim yet. Down. I thought there might be something over there. I knew I had to jump down, but... Hmm. Oh, now I can go this way. Uh -huh. Open up this little shortcut. Yeah. Okay, fish temple. Fish temple. Oh, this is going to be like in Bloodborne, when you go to the place with all the Sequoigan everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that didn't work. Uh, I have a suspicion, though, that I'm going to get swim power in this dungeon. Mm. You think? I don't know what's giving me that that premonition, but I've got a 
Sneaking suspicion. It's the compass! There's a secret! I've been hiding under my skin! My heart is human! My blood is boiling! My brain IBM! Remember that? So if you see me acting strangely, don't be surprised! You got a key! I genuinely think that Sticks kicks ass. Because, um... Yeah, it's all right. yeah. yeah, they're awesome. I got nothing bad to say about Sticks. I, I will say that the whole the whole album that Mr. Roboto comes from is very corny. Because it's a concept <laughs> album and that's part of the song, the story. But corny's not necessarily a bad thing. Mm -hmm. You found a beak! Hmm. Just looking around here, see what I can see what I can find before I have to open any doors. You found the map. See, that's helpful. That was quick. <laughs> nice to find him early. Here we go. God damn it! <laughs> There's a secret. No, those are pea hats for sure. Yep. I wanted those bombs more than I <laughs> wanted that half a heart. Oh, look at this. Aha. <laughs> it was all too easy, Starscream. You got a key! Yay! Does it do the thing? No. Oh, could I get up to the room up here yet? I don't think I could. Oh yeah, I can. I can just walk right in. Well. Hello. <laughs> ah! I hit the wrong button to set down a bomb. Yeah, we go. Whoops. Oh, yep. God damn it. Another one. Ah, Ooh. god damn it. I'm out of here. That room sucks. <laughs> oh, I should put a guillotine emote in our chat. What do you think, yeah. Aaron? What was the other ones? I thought of a bunch I was at work and I was going to go put a man. Uh -uh. I got the important ones the other day, which was a barbecue pit boy and John Panay Ramsey. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I called the what John. Was it? Yeah, it was a good one too. <laughs> There's a secret. <clears throat> My audience is Republican? How? Are they just rage watching me? <laughs> because. <laughs> oh, they believe in royalty. Okay, I got gotcha. you. <laughs> Why did I drown right there? 
Maybe I was just like right on the hitbox or something. No, I wanted that. <clears throat> There's no way I can make that jump. I have to come back when I can swim. Yep. Tyler, you don't believe in Bigfoot? Is that what you're mm -hmm. implying right there? Because I do. How dare you, Tyler? I really want to start a paranormal investigation uh, company, Eric. Where I just use my expertise to yeah. and belief to uh, to to really get to the bottom of things, you know. I think that it's fucking useless. <laughs> Thanks for throwing that key into the abyss for God me, you damn. assholes. <laughs> See what this owl has to say for himself. The glint of the tile will be your guide. All right, thanks. gonna be some fucking puzzle that I could have easily solved on my own. Probably. <laughs> ooh, ooh, three in one stroke there. Well done. I mean, it wasn't great. I like the music in this uh, dungeon. Bro. Are you guys invincible when you're flying? That's something. No, oh, it was just a slime. It's just a slime. Or I guess a chew in this game. Well, I don't know. The chews are like the, Oh, the uh, chews are the, yeah, the things that walk around. What are those things, then? Um, yeah, I don't know. Eric, do you believe in Bigfoot? Mm, not really. But... Really? I wish it were real, though. If Bigfoot was... Hold on. This is that puzzle. <laughs> okay, that's the wrong one. Fuck out of here. Nope. Uh -oh. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure you can do this. Yeah, I can't do it yet, I don't think. There's a secret. Was it that key? It could have been. But I don't know. I think it was. I can't move that. Have to come at that from the other side, I think. Huh? Is this what we're doing now? Yeah, singing everything to the little tune that it plays, yeah. Why not? <laughs> I think what Tyler was saying is that he doesn't believe in a monarchy. In royalty. I believe in it, though. I mean, Bigfoot, not... Not like kings and queens and stuff. Here's what I believe, Eric, is that I believe that Bigfoot is just as real as we make him. 
I think that there is somewhat of a there is a uh, somewhat of a, a tulpa sort of influence. I don't think that he's <laughs> physically manifested in the world, but it's like I've said before. Like you can say that Slenderman isn't real, right? But that little girl who got stabbed fourteen times by her friends, right? <laughs> Slenderman is very real to that little girl. Um, and in some way was manifested physically through these two people who believed in him because they were severely mentally deranged as I assume what their deal was and were untreated for this illness oh hey it's this guy oh hey just like in there uh, shit Almost got him. <laughs> He's backing it up. Oh shit. Make scrooge noises. I like that. That's pretty funny. Oh, that didn't work. That. You gotta wait for him at the corner. There we go. There we go. My bottle's already full, so I'm just gonna take him. What's in here? What do we got? Now, ah, whoa! No! Oh, yeah. It's the first of one of these, huh? <laughs> Stop shooting at me! Hell yeah! Ah, yeah! I got my little flippers. Oh, I didn't need that. What are these things? The bongos? I think this was from Twilight Princess. I can't remember any other games they were in. Were they? Yeah, yeah, like, check their mask. Uh, mask I see. I might think there's some other one. I can swim I now. I'm probably right. Uh, that's one thing that I kind of missed from, um, Breath of the Wild, is yeah. this kind of thing, where, like, there's sort of a Metroidvania aspect to it. Right. Even if you didn't get permanent upgrades in Breath of the Wild, I think that it would have been beneficial to, like, oh, maybe I need to come back here with a boomerang later. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like... This one maybe? Oh. No. Alright. So it's here. The left, the right. Here. Here. Middle. Here. And there. What did Yay. I get? A staircase? Is there anything on this floor I need to get first? Uh, yeah, there's a couple of chests scattered around. Let me go run and grab them.
Did you hear, did you see that one thing that Justin McElroy posted a long time ago? What? <laughs> where there was, um, uh, like a tree fell on some girl's car and it was on the local news in Huntington. Mm-hmm. And, uh, they, they interviewed one of his neighbors and it was this, like, real hilljack looking guy. And he goes, oh, yeah, yeah. that poor little girl's not gonna be able to get to school now. <laughs> <laughs> I really loved that guy. I forgot about that. That was funny. Just the way he says it. That poor girl's not gonna be able to get to school now. I love that. Um, that's a good illustration of what kind of a. Uh, a place Huntington is that somebody's car getting crushed by a tree makes right. local news. <laughs> <laughs> like the place where I live, there's murders. Like, <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, we had more murders in Chicago this year, I think. Pretty oh, good. <laughs> oh, this guy's scary. Oh, I don't like when he smiles. <laughs> A good year for murders. <laughs> oh, wait, hang on. God damn it. Ow! What am I doing wrong, oh. Eric? So close! <laughs> yes! Ha 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 ha, you <laughs> stupid <laughs> bastard! Wait, did that just leave me over here? I could have always just gone here? <laughs> Bullshit. Alright, fine, I'll go down those stupid stairs over here. Oh wait, no, I'm not there. Bill, this sounds like a sex thing you're talking about that you want to see. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, get crushed by him. Huh? Take your shoes off. <laughs> did get you see? Uh, did you see that post uh, of the person saying, "Oh, I got an, uh, an HD screen cap of Elsa's feet in Frozen 2," and they just uploaded a, a, a like a dark gray <laughs> like PNG that had nothing in it. And then people are in the mentions going, it, it won't load for me. Can you re-upload it? Dear <laughs> Lord. Every day we get further from the Lord's warmth, Eric. It's funny. Like, we were talking about that foot stuff the other day. I get it, I guess. Like, it's, here's the thing. I'm not into right. it, but I get it. Like, you know, like, it's a degrading thing. Like, you know, feet are, like, nasty. So you're like, yeah, hey, yeah, give me the nasty parts. <laughs> Both at the same time. I'm invincible. Well, I want to see if I can push any of these. I can't. I don't think there's anything back this way. Wait, can I push this one? I don't think I can. <laughs> I don't know. 
feet are gross. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But I don't think I don't think that somebody's necessarily gross for being into them. I guess there's a lot worse things you could be into, right? right. Like you know, <laughs> if somebody's got a foot fetish, at least they're not like a necrophiliac or something. Like, right? <laughs> anyway, Eric, this was my way of going a uh, roundabout way of saying that it's okay that I have a foot fetish. Yeah, it's fine. What's the point of going through here? I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Oh well. <laughs> I'm slightly lost now, I guess. Maybe uh, I'll go get in the little warpy thing. Let me ride it back to the front of the dungeon? Yeah. Oh, no, I can't go that way to get it, though. <clears throat> Do you remember the episode of King of the Hill where uh, Peggy um, gets involved in uh, the foot fetish website? <laughs> Vaguely. <laughs> she, uh, some guy's just like, I just want to take some pictures of your feet. <laughs> and she's just like, oh, my feet. She's, like, self-conscious about her big feet. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, he's like, yes, I'm an artist, and this is the kind of art I create. And, like, he has her just, like, right. stomping on a dozen eggs and shit. <laughs> King of the Hill was a that was a good cartoon. Very strange but good cartoon. <laughs> oh, I never went down that staircase. I don't think. <laughs> Let's go down here. No oh, more of this shit. Nope. Oh, it's that key that I had earlier. Aha. Uh -huh. Aha! Uh, now I know what I'm doing. Now we're cooking with gas, baby. And look, you can see the flippers. Oh, yeah? Go back. Oh, look! Got a little kicky feet. That's fun. <laughs> no! It would be fun to do, like, a diorama of this room. Yeah, it would be. But we can resin. <laughs> yeah, make the water resin. Yeah. Sort of... I think that, uh, that would be something fun to do. <laughs> I got a good hookup on some resin, man. Um, oh, yeah? Yeah. Uh, the shit that I bought, uh, just most recently, it cures mm -hmm. in, like, 15 minutes. Wow. So that means that, like, when I'm experimenting, I can do all kinds of crazy stuff, like, in an afternoon's time. Mm hmm Which is exciting. I am going to smoke that resin, and it will probably kill me, Tyler, because it's, it's chemicals. <laughs> uh, from Chris, they said whenever they got a foot guy, it was similar to the King of the Hill episode. Really? <laughs> so he just wanted her to, like, jump on, like, a pound of raw beef or something. Um, I worked with a lady when I worked at the hotel who was a, a, a cam model. And she used to tell me about all the weirdos, but she was just like, like, I used to just go on there. And then like, there was one guy who didn't even want me to get naked or touch myself or anything. He just wanted me to count backwards from 100 and tell him he can't come until I get to one. God. And she was like, and then, and then she was like, and he bought new tires for my van. Like, like, what? she was just oh. like, that's like, that's so good. It was the count. <laughs> It was! It was the count! <laughs> One! Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> but yeah, like, she's she just... And so I was like, so what did that look like? And she's just like, well, I just go, 100, 
99... 98 and she kind of like did it in that like kind of like anticipatory flirty voice and i was like and he gets off to it she's just like yeah all right oh i need to no, count <laughs> count this little point yeah <laughs> but she was like she's always happy when he contacts her because she can make a few hundred bucks and all she has to do is count to a hundred <laughs> Oh, look, I can attack in the water. Sorry, fish. <laughs> Here I come. That's it. She started doing the counting, and I was like, <gasps> This is it. This is my fetish. And then I proposed to her. <laughs> right then and there. I have uh, a confession. <laughs> I have a confession to make, guys. I'm, I'm a number fetish guy. Um, oh, I didn't get the nightmare key, though. Uh, it's in that room down there, I assume. Or it's in that room over to the right. Yeah. Oh, you could go down. At the, the swamp. Swamp room. Oh, can you? Like, after the stairs. In the room with the thwomps? No, the room you went to after. You did the swamp thing. And you're like, what do I do here? No, oh, it's Swamp Thing, Eric. <laughs> That's the name of the comic oh, book. <laughs> Now I gotta remember where the fuck that was. It's over here, isn't it? <laughs> uh, Lori was the one that got uh, mugged at the hotel. Remember that whole debacle? No. Um, so that was when I was a manager there. And uh, she and I were working together, and I was preparing for a banquet, and she was working front desk. And um, she was going home, and she said, hey, before I leave, I just want to go grab a... Go uh, oh. Oh, I just jumped off the thing, and I have to do that again. <laughs> Fuck off. It's fine, I'm going. And uh, I was like, yeah, sure, no problem. Go get a Coke. And she's like, yeah, just one to take home with me. And I said, yeah, go to the vending machine, go get a Coke. I'll watch the front uh -huh. desk. And she's gone a long time, and I figured she's, like, fucking around or, like, I don't know, making a phone call. Right. I didn't yeah. give a shit, honestly. Like, But she comes back, like, five or ten minutes later. Because I thought maybe she had to go to the bathroom or something. <clears throat> and her face is all swollen up. God. And uh, she was she had a bloody nose and her eye was completely swollen shut. And she's like, somebody attacked me. And they took my purse. I was like, oh shit, Lori, sit down on the floor right now. And I said, and she was like, does my eye look bad? Does my eye look bad? I'm like, no, it looks fine. It looked really bad. <laughs> and I was like, uh -huh. hey, Lori, you need to sit down. I'm calling the I'm calling nine one one. Oh, do you gonna be okay? Yeah, you'll be fine. I don't know if she was okay. Um, but, uh, so the ambulance comes, the police come, and they're like, did you see anything? And I'm like, no. She just came in and she looked like this, and I called you guys. They were like, well, okay. Um, no big deal. <laughs> they left. Uh, and then uh, the clerk that was on after that was, um was female and she was nervous about staying alone i just said to her i'll stay here with you like wait you. why is this so hard yeah there <laughs> and so uh i stayed overnight 
I worked like a 16 hour shift and like we called my boss and we were like, hey, this See, happened. Let me do this again. <laughs> oh, brother. <laughs> the boss of this dungeon is that fucking thwomp, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> uh, but anyway, so I called my boss and I was like, I'm staying tonight. And they're like, yeah, stay with... Uh, I think Kylie was her name. Yeah, I think it was Kylie. And, uh... Kylie Minogue? Yeah, it was Kylie Minogue. She, before she got her big break as a singer, she was a, a clerk at the wow. at the hotel where I used to work. Uh, she was really nice. She's a really good singer, obviously. Um, <laughs> and, uh... So... Kylie says to me, Hey, I want you to go across the street... Uh, to the gas station and get me a pack of cigarettes. And I'm like, yeah, sure. No problem. She didn't want to be walking around out at night if there's a, you know, a purse snatcher running around. I said, yeah, I'll run across the street and grab us some cigarettes. And, um... So I go over there and I see some people, like, monkeying around over in the, uh... over in the restaurant parking lot. And it's like 3 a.m., right? Like, nobody's supposed to be over there. Because uh, there was a restaurant attached to the hotel, a bar and a restaurant. And, um... I, uh... I called the cops and I said, Hey, one of my one of my uh, desk clerks was attacked tonight, and now there's some suspicious-looking okay. people in our parking lot. Yep, yeah, wait. Okay. I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to be pissed if that was like a fucking rupee or something. Right. <laughs> okay, I want to go over there and get that other one too, though. That other chest that I've missed. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go get it. Uh, Before you get the sniper. You're right. You're sorry again. <laughs> uh, so, uh, the cops say they'll have somebody drive by. <laughs> I said, okay, thanks. And, uh... They, uh, we never hear from the cops, right? right? And we're like, what the fuck happened? So I call the cops back a little while later, and I'm like, hey, did you drive somebody by? Like, you know, my desk clerk got robbed earlier, and now there's some suspicious people in right. our parking lot. And he's like, uh, yeah, we sent somebody out. We didn't see anything. Um... But thanks. Have a good well, night. That's it. And uh, I said okay. And then I uh, I went home, went to bed, and then like, uh, so I went home at like five thirty. I just told Kylie like I'm too fucking tired. I'm going home. She's like okay, cool. The sun's up anyway. And so I went home, went down, lay to bed. About eight o'clock, I get a phone call. They're opening the restaurant, and they said, hey. Somebody went into the restaurant and stole the safe. God damn I'm it. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Apparently, they wheeled the entire <laughs> safe out of the office on the office chair and then took the chair as well, which is really funny. <laughs> <laughs> and, like, the chest had, like, Jesus. $75 in it. Like, it was, like, nothing. Oh, God. <laughs> Like, the chair in the safe costs more than the money in the safe. Right, I know he's pissed. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's my story about Lori getting punched in the face. Um, that's my Lori story. That's my Lori story about Lori, who uh, was a former camera model, getting punched in the face. <laughs> and, uh... Uh, she was also the one that had a pimple on her butt, and it was on a tattoo she had on her ass. <clears throat> and she was asking me to pop it for her, because she didn't want the pimple ruining the tattoo. And I was like, Lori, I'm not going to pop a zit on your bare ass. And the fact that you're asking me to do it is very unprofessional. <laughs> I was like, I'm your manager, Lori. <laughs> Uh, also, uh, Lori was also, like, 50. She wasn't a young woman. Uh, so I guess in the cam scene, she was the MILF demographic, but... 
It was really funny. She was like, I can feel it. It's getting bigger. And I was like, God damn it, Lori, no. Put your ass away. <laughs> um, Eric, I forgot where I needed to go to get in there. <laughs> Me too. Uh, it was a stairwell. Hmm. It was that stairwell around the bend. I'm good. I found it. <laughs> Excuse me, P-Hats. I got a boss to go kill. <laughs> I'll swim under them. <laughs> Suckers. <Yeah. laughs> Gallery two peeps. I got shit to do. Mm. Oh, the tattoo on her ass was a heart and a rose, by the way, for anybody who's curious. <laughs> Which is a very funny thing to have tattooed on your butt cheek, I think. <laughs> Oh, here's where the boss is. Ah! Ah! Bloop, bloop, glub, glub. Oog food, <laughs> bloop, glub. <laughs> Something that I myself have said in my life. <laughs> Ow. I wonder what the weak point is. Hmm. I don't feel like you'd have a lot of room to maneuver on the Game Boy. <laughs> right? Yeah. What's a fetish thing now? The, f the fish? Get out of here. You're distracting me. Am I doing something wrong or does this thing just have a shitload of HP? Nah, I think it just takes a while. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> hmm. Look at that cold stare of that killer there. <laughs> Yay! I have a feeling that was difficult to play on the Game Boy. I don't know why. Yeah, it was... It was very easy for me just now. I remember that bit harder. I got the surf harp! Or the worst night in all the land, surf harp. <laughs> Yay! I did it! Bay! Your road goes to the bay. Okay. Alright. Now we can swim. Beautiful. <coughs> Thank you. Hmm. That was an easy one. Guess that's it. <laughs> I also keep forgetting that this game was originally on Game Boy. So when something is really easy, I'm like, oh, it's because this was designed to be played in, like, a car. 
right. <laughs> <laughs> so far I'm really enjoying this game though you're right this is one of the better 2D Zeldas yes. uh, I'm impressed that they were able to refine the Zelda formula on console or like on a handheld you right. know yeah oh okay. sup I am Manbo, child of the sunfish. Have you got an ocarina? Ah, then I can teach you my song, Blue. <laughs> what? <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Great. That was rad. <laughs> when you play my mambo, you can warp to a warp. Oh, that's awesome! Cool. Special day, I'll let you warp to Mambo's pond too. Cha cha cha. I like this <laughs> guy. <laughs> I think you can only warp to the the pond with that. Hmm. That was awesome. Um, you know what I would like to see them do is another like like Mario All Stars style release, where they like update all the yeah. graphics and stuff, but it's the same game. I would love to see them do that, but like include like the Game yeah. Boy games and stuff. Oh, I didn't think that would work. Well. Ah! What the fuck? Oh, right, the ghost. Is he bad? I don't think so. <laughs> Alright. I'll let him follow me around. Oh, looky here. What have we here? Yeah, I want to play some... I want to play the Wario Land games. I never really have gone all the way through yeah. them. For some reason, I only played... the first one. Yeah? The house. The take other me. The house at the bay. Alright, I'll take you. So this is the worst one. The worst one. <laughs> Yeah, I ought to download those. And, well, you know what? I already have downloaded them. Maybe I should just play them <laughs> at some point. I think I gave them a try as a kid but didn't understand it. Yeah. Because I think I was trying to play it with, like, Mario, but it's kind of a puzzle game, isn't it? Like, right. like yeah. you've got to use Wario's powers to traverse the level in Two clever lines. waves. The first was basically just a Mario game. Oh, okay. He wants me to take him to the house of the bay. Where's the bay? Martha's Bay. Alright, let's go. Yeah, I'm taking you. Like, just chill. Come on, we're gonna swim. <laughs> this opens up a whole lot of new uh, traversal <laughs> options as well. Can I swim under him? Yeah, see a sucker. Oh, look, a mermaid. All oh, right, she's from the training. When I was swimming in the bay, the waves took a very important necklace from around my neck. If you find it, I will let you take a scale from my tail. All right, thank you. A from your tail. I like the noise the ghost makes. Oh, sounds <laughs> miserable. I have a uh, I have a big file on my computer that's just like 
all of the classic Nintendo oh, I... ROMs. Yep, I did that once too. Yeah, because Nintendo doesn't want you playing any of these games. Right. <laughs> Which I genuinely do not see. Right. I do not understand why they don't just say, Hey, let's release our entire catalog on the Wii Shop. We just throw a little cheap emulator on there. I mean, they started doing that. <laughs> and yes, that's on the yes. But it should be every game. Yes. And, and like, like, you buy what? a subscription. Yeah. Or, or, or they just sell them for two or three bucks a pop. Right. Because, like, how, what is the infrastructure needed for that to do, like, a 56 kilobyte download? Like, and host, like, like, like exactly. a megabyte yeah. file. <laughs> like, <laughs> There, there, it can't be that much of a commitment. Well, as a matter of fact, I downloaded an, enti an entire... The entire library of these games, and it took, like, 15 right. minutes, like, to download on my computer. And if they gave me, like, an easy way to play them on my Switch, yeah, I'd probably pay for them at this point. Right. <laughs> so silly to me. But no, I guess we'll just let everybody else take Nintendo's money. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. Nintendo's not that bad of a company when it comes to that kind of shit. <clears throat> oh, that's probably true too, Tyler, but... <laughs> then again, like, <laughs> why not just find somebody who already has built an emulator and just hire them and say, here, make this work on Switch. Right. <laughs> Where am I supposed to go? He told me the house on the bay. You jump over that. I don't know why I just walked right jump into over him. Those holes? I don't think I can because I'll hit the bushes, won't I? No, not here. Uh... Oh, these bushes over here? Yeah. Oh, I've been down to the left. Yeah, these? The holes are right here. Oh, here, the house. I came in here earlier. Am I watching a scene? Oh, yeah, I am. Okay. I, I didn't know if he was just kind of hovering. Nostalgia unchanged. <laughs> he looks sad, and I feel bad for him. Oh, gross. Boo <laughs> 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 hoo. Enough cemetery, take me my grave. Alright. Gotta break some shit first. See ya! <laughs> <laughs> Where was the cemetery again? All the way up there. Alright, we'll go. Fine, if I have to. Can not kill the monkey? Guess not. Can you imagine, like... Link is like, I gave you that fucking dog food, like, four weeks ago. Like, a month ago. <laughs> like, if, if this was happening in real time <laughs> as we play it, you're still talking about it? Like... That's good dog food. <laughs> Am 
My dog eats dog food. He sure does. <laughs> My grave! With the flowers! We're going! Going to the cemetery. Man, imagine what a pain in the ass it must be. Like, if you live here, to go to the cemetery to, like, put some flowers on a relative's grave. Right. <laughs> oh, wait, hang on. Look out for the monsters! Yeah, nice. I think this one's quicker. Because this one I'll have to go all the way around, won't I? Yeah, let's do this. Yeah! There he is. Come on, you ghost. There's a boy outside. He's... He's killing all those crows with a sword. <laughs> Is this your grave? I was down here earlier. Is this it? Hmm. Oh, I can't get that one yet, I don't think. I think I need the hook shot. I can yeah, blow that up. Yeah, I bet, they, I bet I need the hook shot. Okay, grave with flowers. <laughs> I'm not seeing a grave with flowers. Different cemetery? And these guys got a lot of health, too. Hmm. Can you go further to the left? Yeah, I'm going that way. See if there's something hmm. down here, maybe? No. Yeah, I don't remember where it is. It said the cemetery, and we're at the cemetery. My green. Mm -hmm. What kind of crows are these that it takes two hits with a sword to kill them? Right. <laughs> the grave with the flowers. Hmm. I mean, there's a flower there, but... Yeah, that's this way. <laughs> oh, Celeste is playing Fire Emblem. Remember Celeste? Yeah. Oh, here it is. I found it. You're welcome. A jar for you. Put it's something inside. Bye-bye. Oh, it gave me a jar. That's good. Yay. Cool. Oh. It's the owl. Ho, ho. Hoot! It has been some time since our paths crossed, lad. 
You must dive into the waters of Martha's Bay and into the catfish's maw. The closer you get to the windfish, the more restless he sleeps. Carry onward, Hoot! Uh, I'm gonna warp to uh, Animal Village and see if uh, that hippo was the one that wanted the hibiscus. I think she's at Animal Village. <laughs> see if we can't knock that one out, right? Whoosh. Yep. Oh. <laughs> This guy again. This guy. <laughs> I like him. He's a big old bear. He's cooking his food. Big old bear. He's hungry. That smells good. Smells good. What is this room? Right. I <laughs> you. I'm interested. <laughs> Wait, did I just go into this one? Oh. So. Did I meet this one? Oh, you brought me a hibiscus. How sweet. It wasn't the hippo, oh, sure. it was this okay. lady. Oh, is she a goat? She's got little horns. Uh, Mr. Yeah, Wright, I, I would so. like you to take this letter to Mr. Wright, who lives on the border of the mysterious forest. Okay. Letter. It is the goat's letter. She's a cute little goat. Oh, I, I know where Mr. Wright is, too. Yep. <laughs> Alright, well, let's go do that, too. Yep. Uh, that's Mr. Wright's house right there, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Yeah. Pyong! I feel like this is a much more productive stream than last week. Last week I kept getting distracted and in the weeds with shit and Right. This week we're getting shit done, man. We're finishing quests, we're finding stuff, we're beating monsters. Yeah. Though I did get lost for a long time in that one. Yeah, two weeks ago, actually. Oh yeah, it was two weeks ago, wasn't it? Is this Mr. Wright's house? Yeah. Yeah. It's Will Wright. There's a dork. What's this? A letter for me? I'm so happy. There came with a photograph of Princess Peach! What the hell? Mmm, she's so beautiful. I must give you something for your trouble. Huh, it looks like all I have is this broom. How'll that be? Alright. Okay. Uh, broom is a road for Mr. Wright, but what was that? <laughs> Uh, uh, oh, I bet the witch would like the broom, right? Yeah. Witches like brooms. Witches love them. Or wait, no, didn't the lady in, uh, Mabe Village say she wanted a broom? Oh. Or am I making that up? Yeah, let's try that. Like, didn't the Bow Wow lady say she wanted a broom? Or no, the old woman did. The old lady. The one that goes, Wahoo! Give <laughs> the what? <laughs> yahoo, yahoo! A new broom for me! It is, isn't it? 
In return, you can have this fishing hook I found when I swept the riverbank. Mm. Oh, sorry, dog. Whoops. Uh, this might be too obvious, but... Do you want a fishing hook? Kind of think. Get in here, you fucker. Yeah. You got a fish. I want that one right down below me. This guy. Come on. Whoa. Do you see it? Oh, look at that. How delicious. Haha, yeah. <laughs> sorry, fucker. You're mine. <laughs> Go on. Delunker. 17 rupees. Oh, yeah. Oh. I'm gonna fish all these it's fish. It's a belonker. It's a belonk. <laughs> <laughs> Bobby, are you okay? <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's a joke only the two of us will get, huh? <laughs> Bill, you, you ass belonker. <laughs> Ah! Ah! Size of that guy. Ooh. Yeah, I do. <laughs> We're going after the cheap cheap. Come on. Do you not see it? It's right there. Whoa! Oh, oh. oh, I fucked that up. <laughs> oh, okay. I think this guy down at the bottom might have a prize of some kind. <laughs> Mm -mm. Come on, give a little bite. <laughs> You're coming with me, you fucker. God damn it! Damn it. I'm done. I'm out of here. Oh, Fuck this. Uh, I'm gonna go look down by the ocean and see if anybody wants a fish hook. <clears throat> doot, doot. Do you want a fish hook? He doesn't have a fur coat at all, you crazy lady. He's a big metal ball. Made of iron. I'm just gonna walk along the shore and see if I can find anybody fishing. If there's nobody down here, Eric, we're gonna stop for the night. 
if there is somebody down here, we're gonna beat the game tonight. No, that's probably not true. We got a ways to go. <laughs> oh, wait. Whew. Is the boomerang in this game, Eric? Or is it just the hook shot? Oh. Is that wall bobbable back? Back that way? Which wall? That down to the right. Oh, yeah, it is. Good eye, Ringo. Good eye, mate. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Okay. <coughs> well, when you go in here, there's a grunt noise. And there's a thing back there, like a yellow thing. Yeah, I'm not sure. Can you play that song of the animal village? In that house that... Oh, yeah. Let's try that. <laughs> yeah, I don't remember. Let's go! Yeah. Oh, what if I play it with her? No reaction. Oh, look! Nothing. Yahoo, a new broom. Superb. I'm glad you like it. Oh, you know, I think it's another song. Oh, is it? For this place, yeah. Go away. I'm Shul, son of a bitch. The mermaid statue by the bay is my masterpiece. <laughs> To tell you the truth, that work is not complete. The art is difficult for you to grasp, is it not? I guess. Uh, where do I turn in my seashells? Where was that again? I don't remember. Mm. Let me Let's see. see. Oh, Eric's gonna look it up, everybody. No, I'm just gonna look at the map. Oh, let's look at the map. Let's see. Let's see. It was a building shaped like a seashell, wasn't it? That makes sense. I think it's in like the plains area. Is it in the plains? Hmm. I'm not sure. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Let's just do that for yeah, half an hour. I don't remember, I don't remember where I was either. Yeah. Is that it to the right? Go up. Go up and to the right. Yes, that is it. Moving further to the right. Yeah. That's it right there. Yep. That's the one. Yep. Alright, let's head that way. 
we'll do that and then we'll uh we'll call her quits for the evening i want to see if i can get any more prizes for the shells i found uh oh i guess this is kind of the closest one isn't it well shit well, there you go. looks like we're just looks like we're just hoofing it i wonder if i can kill these guys by throwing a bush at them yeah Yeah, get out of here. Take that. Hope you like bushes, because that's what I'm throwing at you is a is a bush. No. Ah, see you, Zora, loser. <laughs> Here it is. Get away from there! That's where I'm going! Be gone! No. We get enough. Come on! Oh, yeah, baby! Hell yeah! What do I get? A tuning fork! Oh, a seashell sensor! Ooh. Oh, that's new. Uh, reacts to sh can be turned on or off with A. That's good! Excellent. That's, I'm pretty sure that's new. Jesus. Those, boys, down. those guys weren't giving up, were they? Ah, looky there. Uh -huh. Yeah, this is gonna be good. Oh. Okay. oh, well, at least we can work it now. I That's see. Perfect. It'll go dong when I get close. There, that's handy though, as I explore around here. I'll find the ones that I'm missing. Yeah. Get a really powerful sword. Ah, look! Aha! Is it in one of the trees? Um, oh, it's in that grass spot right there. Yeah, next to the uh, owl. I betcha, so next to the owl, yeah. How do I get up there? Mm, not this way. Not this way. <clears throat> hmm. How do I get up there? Let's look at the map. I need to go up and around through here, I suspect. <laughs> and then into one of these two cave holes, I bet. Alright, let's do that. Uh, is that the cemetery? What? There's a staircase under one of the Graves? No, I don't know. Um. No, I think I just need to go up and around here. And I just go up and around through here, God, and then down yeah, through here, and then in. I think. Well. We'll see. We'll see. It'll be fine. Whew. I'm bound and determined to get this shell before we end tonight, Eric. Right. <laughs> Did 
thing. I really like that. Nah. Ah! He really doesn't want to be falling down there. Nope, leave me alone. Oh, there's one down here, too. We'll investigate. Hmm. Alright, maybe you'll do that rock. Oh, yeah. I bet you're right. You got a shell. Hell yeah. They play a slightly less triumphant version of it when you get a shell or something. Right there. <laughs> yeah. Shell. We found it. Here we go. I like the way those things look. They look cool. Yeah. Little spider guys. Tektites! They're not tektites, but... <laughs> some kind of critter. Aha! Aha! That's how we do it. Wait, what? Okay, he's going around and... I can't move either jump. of these and get in there. Jump. I can jump over the pit, yeah, but I want to go over there. Maybe we can move these. Aha. There we go. You were right, Eric, the whole time. What have I stood you? I should have known. Often. <laughs> but hey. What was that one that I got really mad at you about? Where, like, I was right and you the were wrong, basket. but I trusted you. Oh, it wasn't up here, Eric. Uh-oh. Hmm. Son of a god, there it is. There it is. <laughs> Just had to dig around a little longer. There was that one time with George Mask. You didn't have a key, you had to go like it. Oh yeah, the, the, that wasn't that wasn't your fault. I was I was mad that I had to do all that, yeah. Right. Yeah. That wasn't <laughs> your fault. I wasn't mad at you, I was just mad. Man, I, right. I feel like there was something that you were wrong about, and you'd convinced me you were right, and I wasted a whole bunch <laughs> of time on something, and I was just fucking furious with you. <laughs> yeah, probably. There's probably been something at some point. I remember when you got so mad at me when we were playing Saints Row. <laughs> <laughs> and we, we we were you kept falling off of that thing and you were climbing up to the top and I hit you yep. with a baseball bat at the top and sent you flying away. <laughs> and you were like, Sam, no! <laughs> you were so mad. Oh, it was wonderful. It was pretty funny, bro. It was. In hindsight, after you realized I could unlock the checkpoint for you. All right, all right. <laughs> All right. Well, I think that's uh, yeah. I think that's good for a Zelda stream tonight. What do you think, Rick? Yeah. What, about these, what do you think of these pigs? Tough little Not customers, aren't they? Look at him. pig's dead. He's trying to get me. He can't. Ha ha. Let's not forget this. All right, everybody, Same. thanks for watching. Uh, my name's been Sam. This has been Eric. We play some video games online. You ever been online?
Don't try to get rid of it. Never will. <laughs>